Hey friend, thank you so much for jumping on so that we could spend a few minutes together. You know, if I had my way, I would be sitting across the table from you with a cup of coffee so that we could have a two-way conversation where I could hear from your heart and you could hear from mine because so many of you have such amazing stories to tell. And I wish that I could hear every single one of them. I know that's not really practical, but a girl can dream, right? So I'm thinking that this might kind of be the next best thing. I've got my coffee, and if you're not driving, you can press pause and go grab yours or grab your tea, whatever works for you. And for the next couple of minutes, I just wanna share a few things that are in my heart for every girl of every generation that calls Christ Fellowship their home or that has been impacted in some way by the movement that we call sisterhood. See, Sisterhood at Christ Fellowship, it isn't really a ministry that takes place at a specific time and place. It's a movement of women of all generations just figuring out together what it means to walk confidently in the calling and purpose that God has placed on our lives, deeply connected in community and really committed to be a collective force for change in the lives of women in our own communities and around the world. And many of you watching, you know that part of our sisterhood code is that sisters stay strong when they stick together. And this was never more true than in 2020. For so many of you, sisterhood was a lifeline that you hung on to during the storms of the last season. And I'm so proud of so many of you that threw that lifeline to others. And in a season that could have been a setback, it really set us up for more girls than ever before to jump into groups online and more girls than ever to in this season of isolation, they found life-giving community in young adults and student ministry. And as a sisterhood, we also set up small businesses in Thailand for girls coming out of human trafficking. We made sure that many of our single moms had groceries, rent, and reliable transportation. And you may not even know it, but as a sisterhood, we gave 4,000 Christmas presents for kids all across South Florida. Honestly, I could not be more proud of you. And as I look ahead into the future, I don't want any one of you to miss out on what's ahead. So what I want you to do is I want you to grab a pen and paper or take some notes in your phone and here we go. First of all, in the next couple of weeks, we are kicking off our sisterhood small groups at all of our campus locations and online. And if you've never been a part of a small group before, we want to make it really easy for you this year. See, a couple of years back, I wrote this study called Flourish, and I wrote it with you in mind. I poured out my heart and soul into this study because I really believe that God wants you to flourish in every area of your life. He wants you to flourish in your career, in your calling, and in your relationships, in your finances. And we as a sisterhood, we wanna help you to do that. So we're making it easy. There's gonna be flourish groups launching at all of our campus locations on site at every campus. And all you have to do to sign up is text the word sisterhood to 441 441 and we'll make sure that we get you connected. And if you're a student or a young adult, we have not forgotten about you. There are groups for you too. And all you have to do to be a part of it is to go to our website or follow CF students and CF young adults on social media. Okay, secondly, so the first week of every month, I'm gonna be sending you and all of our sisterhood groups an update and a short conversational teaching. A couple of things I want you to know is to remember, I said that I wanted this to be a conversation. And so I wanna answer some of your questions. If you have any questions that you'd like me to answer, you can text your questions by sending the word Julie to 441-441. And the first teaching is coming your way today. So make sure that you watch the video and also follow us on CF Sisterhood social media and send the message to a friend because I know it will be an encouragement to them too. Our March update is going to be really, really special. I'm not gonna give it all away right now, but I will be announcing a very special event that we are gonna be hosting in May with an incredible speaker. But you're gonna have to stay tuned to find out who it is. Girls, I love you so much, and I can't wait to catch up again real soon. See you at church this weekend.